Hello students, welcome back. In this session, we are going to discuss some of the problems from the uh, pre-final examination uh, questions. This is set 3 and uh, now we are going to discuss the question number 5. Let me read out uh, this question. A square lamina means ABCD square plane is 40 mm side has a corner A in the HP and its diagonal AC is inclined at 45 degrees to the HP while the diagonal BD is parallel to HP and inclined at 30 degrees to the VP draw its projections. So let's uh, write down the given data. This is set 3. Question 5. Given data would be square plane lamina or plane we can consider same square plane A B C D side is uh, 40 mm A is in HP and uh, diagonal AC is 45 degrees to the HP means this is theta right and uh, diagonal BD is parallel to HP and inclination with the VP is 30 degrees to VP. So let's start the problem. Let's start the problem here. I'll be taking the 45. Uh, see here, A is in uh, HP and AC is 45 degrees inclined to the HP. So now I'll be taking the figure like this. Our plane is 40 mm of side. This is the square lamina or square plane and this is A, this is C, this is B and this is D. Mentioning the dimensions over here. And in the question, it is given that A is lying in the VP. Let me extend this a little bit here because the problem would be coming over this position. And uh, let me project this. So this point would be A dash and this point when you are looking in this direction first B dash then D dash then C dash. So let me darken this. Right next uh, diagonal AC is 45 degrees inclined to the HP this may you can consider this as HP this as VP. HP rotates like this so top view comes here front view comes here. Right. So let me keep this 45 degrees. Forty-five degrees array. Measure this. This point A dash. This is C dash. This is B dash. D dash means diagonal AC is forty-five degrees. Theta forty-five degrees to the HP. Let's darken this. Now project this down for getting the top view.
and project this site so this point this is a b c and d So our diagonal AC is inclined at 45 degrees to the HP and uh, we have finished this one. Next we are going for BD parallel to HP and 30 degrees inclined to the VP. Now we are making this BD diagonal 30 degrees inclined to the VP means uh, this is the VP, this is the HP like this. So your plane is making 30 degrees to the VP. So let's draw an array of 30 degrees on that array we will be drawing our uh, reproducing the same figure over here this is the change of position method thirty degrees array this is phi thirty degrees phi equal to thirty degrees now we have to reproduce the same figure over here this would be D and this would be B right and this would be A this would be the C let's complete the figure with this point We have reproduced the same figure over here. Now draw the projectors above from top view to the front view. Right, and then front view to the side. Right. Now this A projector is going above and A dash projector is coming this side. So A and A dash intersection this would be A dash and C projector is going above and C dash projector is coming here this would be C dash and B projector is coming here and B dash projector is coming here B dash. Next D dash D projector is coming here and D dash projector is coming over here. So this would be the D dash. Let's join this. Now see here coming to the question. It is given that uh, AC diagonal AC is 45 degrees inclined to the HP. See here now AC is diagonal is 45 degrees inclined to the HP same figure is coming over here right AC is 45 degrees inclined to the HP and BD is parallel to HP see here BD is parallel to HP and means height if this is the HP BD would be like this if this is the BD height from the HP would be same parallel to the HP but this is the VP right inclined to the VP 30 degrees see here inclined to the uh, VP 30 degrees inclined to the VP 30 degrees and this one AC is inclined at 45 degrees so by this we have finished uh, this fifth problem I hope everyone understand how to draw this so here we have mentioned the dimensions over here and see this only the figure is dark means projection is dark all the projector lines the rays and other reference lines are light and in this way only you have to draw it by this you can get the full mark so I hope everyone understand how to draw these type of problems onto the drawing sheet. Uh, do follow the uh, channel and subscribe it regularly for getting updates.